Buenas tardes. I would like to take this opportunity to welcome all of you um, to our BCC annual kickoff ceremony to the Hispanic Latino Heritage Month uh, celebration. This is an opportunity that we have to make people more aware of the positive contributions that the Latino and Hispanic cultures have made um, to our society. Today, we're here to honor um, someone who made some very important contributions to this community. Um, and here to introduce our honoree, um, I would like to introduce you to our president, Dr. Jack Spring. Thank you. Thank you, Olivia. Good morning, everyone. Good afternoon. Welcome. Uh, another great event where we celebrate the multicultural strengths of, uh, of Bristol Community College. Uh, the Hispanic Latino is, uh, population is growing in our region uh, rapidly, and uh, as is the numbers of uh, uh, students, uh, that proportion in our student body as well. So we're very happy uh, to be <clears throat> to be accommodating the learning needs uh, of all people. And, uh, and you know, something I always say uh, at these events is that we can't just be satisfied with uh, a month or a week or a day for these celebrations, they go on uh, 24-7, 365. Uh, so while we have a Hispanic Latino month, uh, I do want to urge all of us to continue that celebration uh, and um, recognize the great contributions of the Hispanic Latino population at BCC and in the community every day, not just, uh, just till uh, uh, October 31st. So we're very proud that we're here. We have a distinguished uh, citizen to be uh, honored uh, tonight or today, and uh, very proud to, to welcome him. Um, uh, Milton uh, Clement uh, recently retired, I think Friday was his last day. Uh, so we get him back at work already on Monday. Uh, he was the director of the Multicultural Student Center, uh, the founding director as we just started in a few uh, last year. Uh, 24 years he's been at BCC, and so uh, he can tell a lot of stories, I guess, about uh, what's gone on over these years. He was in the Office of Admissions as a minority student recruiter and retention counselor, and of course also in the Registrar's Office uh, in various capacities, including being registered for the college. Um, He's uh, gone through a number of initiatives at the college and throughout Greater Fall River and New Bedford, uh, very active in multicultural affairs. Um, and I think that uh, his mentorship and his advocacy for uh, our Latino uh, Hispanic population is, uh, is well, well recognized and uh, uh, well honored uh, for the great work that he does. He has been an uh, advisor to the Latino Student Art Association and was a founding member of this Hispanic Heritage Month Committee uh, as he started it out. So he has a passion for bringing people together. Uh, he has been a, a mainstay in events like this uh, and in, throughout student affairs for as long as I can remember. I've been here 15 of those 24 years and uh, doing just terrific work. Uh, so I want to uh, present, if you will join me, uh, to with me to recognize uh, the great work of Milton Clement as a champion uh, for diversity, a champion for multicultural affairs in general, a champion for multicultural students. Uh, and I'm very proud of all that he does to provide an inclusive, welcoming, accommodating environment for our students and for learning and to make sure that learning takes place in the proper context. So please join with me to recognize and uh, celebrate the great work of uh, Milton Clinton. Milton. Thank you, Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
very much. Thank you. Thank you very much, President Spager. I'd like to uh, thank the committee for all the wonderful work that they have done, and I am uh, honored and humbled by your selection of me to uh, accept this recognition. So thank you all for the hard work that you do. Um, I also want to thank Dr. Sprager for all the support over the years for our diversity at BCC and for the decision to establish the Multicultural Student Center. Um, I think that this is probably going to be one of his greatest achievements while he's been president in his great uh, time here at the college. I'd like to invite everyone to be sure to try to uh, attend some of the events that we have this month, celebrating and paying recognition to the contributions and sacrifices that people from the Hispanic Latino community have given to uh, this country. Starting tomorrow, there's going to be a film uh, called No Turning Back by a Latino filmmaker by the name of Jesus Neva. And we're also honored to have him come to BCC next week. So I would hope that those of you who are able to can come to that event and also check out the film first so you have a, a point of reference. So. Uh, I think you get a lot more out of his presentation. Uh, again, I'd like to thank you all for coming out and supporting us. And uh, I'm going to give it back to President Spiegel. So thank you very much to all my friends and colleagues over these many years. Thank you. Congratulations, Bill. Congratulations, Bill. I know you'd want to... Uh individually express your uh, recognition of his great uh, work here at BCC uh, once we get uh, through with this, okay? And uh, this will be very brief. I wanted to thank uh, Bob Rezendis and Tafa uh, Balaju, uh, uh for their work in the uh, Multicultural Committee, uh, which I guess uh, is a home group for the Hispanic uh, Heritage Month Committee as well. Uh, ironically, uh, and it's a happy occasion, that Tafa cannot be with us uh, today. He's actually in Washington accepting an award uh, for Bristol Community College from the Minority Access Incorporated in Washington because of our great and stellar record of, uh, uh, of accommodating and being welcoming for all diverse, uh, diversity and for the multicultural students. So it's, uh, I, I know he's very sorry that he can't be here, but you can understand the importance of this national award and some national recognition for the great work that our BCC family uh, performs every day uh, in embracing and celebrating uh, diversity. You know, it needs to go beyond the food and festival uh, approach uh, to diversity, uh, where we have to ingrain and infuse uh, within the life fabric of, uh, of our college, and we do that. And that's why Tafa is down there now. So I want to thank the uh, multicultural, the College Multicultural Committee. I want to thank the Hispanic uh, Heritage Month Committee. And uh, I think we've got some good food here. I know we have some good food for us to uh, enjoy. Again, we'll celebrate uh, uh, Milton's fabulous lifetime achievement uh, here at BCC. Uh, in this regard, and please uh, help yourself, and I know you'd want to extend your thanks and appreciation to Milton personally. Thank you for coming, everyone. I just want to uh, ask two, two of the members from our committee to please stand and be recognized. Olivia Newbert, please stand. <laughs> and uh, Ana Gaillard. 